Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube, or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. Val, listen, I don't have time for your nonsense right now. Listen, just call up the lowest earners like I have before, and then you can deal with your anger like that, remember? Because I don't have time to deal with you right now. I have clients and new staff members that are coming in. So, deal with your anger yourself. All right, bye. <sighs> Val. Hey, I didn't see you come in. Sorry if you overheard that little spiel I had with my little friend there. Uh, he has anger issues. Now come, come, sit. So, you wanted to work in Vox Tech, right? Great, I always am looking for new employees. So, tell me about yourself. How are you, well, good with technology and whatnot? Oh, you were a technician while you were alive. Oh, that explains your, uh, well, everything about you, your looks and whatnot. Me? Well, <laughs> let's not get into my history now, shall we? So, a technician. Hmm. Well, I've always been looking for a few new ones after the innocence uh, with uh, Valentino. So, I think you would fit the part really nicely. Yeah, of course. I'm always looking for new more and more and more and more people to trust us with their money, safety, and all sorts of things. After all, an overlord like myself has always been on top of things, especially when it comes to innovation. <laughs> Hell, I even started doing angelic security, not even a month ago, I want to say. It's been... It's been slightly difficult, but I've been getting through paperwork and whatnot, and plus, signing off contracts is just as simple as a snap. <laughs> right, sorry. I got a little too much into my own personal business. So, what do you have for me? Oh, really? So, um... What kind of information do you actually have? Oh, I see. That little tiny little app thing on everyone's phones. I thought that got banned years ago. Oh, they recently just put a bill out up in Earth and whatnot. Oh, I see. Well, that's too bad. I got a good few recipes from that app. But who needs it? After all, I could just make my own application. And once I get it out into the world, I'll be able to control everybody's phones and make sure they always tune in when I have a broadcast. <laughs> I'd rather you not bring up that bastard's name. Okay. Great! So, besides the information you got from that bastard, what else do you have? Oh, 
Really? So you're one of those little, tiny, insignificant bastards living inside of that hotel, huh? Alongside with that radio demon that you mentioned? <laughs> well, I mean... I could use another person on the inside to get more information about the hotel. After my first attempt didn't really go as planned. <laughs> well, you could... Let's just say that he got caught on the first day. Stupid serpent. But... I believe you have a just a little bit more brains than that last person has. So, let us cut a deal of some sort, right? Great! So, you are hired, okay? But, you will be still living inside of that hotel. And you will be my middleman to getting information from Alistair... That little brat of a daughter, Lucifer, and all sorts of people who are living inside of that hotel. Tell me everything that you know, once you get the information, that is. Eh, let's not call it spying. Let's, uh, let's say, a cognitive information collecting. That sounds a lot better to me. <laughs> right. Anyway. You are hired, and your pay will be starting at low, but if you get a lot of information for me, then that pay will go right up. <laughs> well, I mean, I need good workers now, don't I? So... I guess the best way to be getting your spirits up for bigger pay is by getting us more information. <laughs> All right, then. So, how about we start you off with just a small, tiny little mission? Okay, so, listen to me. I want you to get as much information out of that red-coated strawberry BASTARD that you can. And once you get it all on recording, you bring it back to me. And then I can now set up a little plan myself to make sure that fucker never comes back and tries to stop my broadcasts ever again. Do I make myself clear? Great! See, I knew you'd be trustworthy. <laughs> I don't think you want it to fail. If you know what I'm trying to say here. All right, then. Hold on. This is Vox. No, no, v Val. Val! Listen, I just told you to call up the lowest earners this month. And what did you do? You didn't listen. You called me back. And I'm in the middle of hiring new people for Vox Tech. So get your shit cleared up without me involved. Got it. All right, then. Go talk to Velvet or something about it. <sighs> Sorry. You know how co-workers can be sometimes. <laughs> anyway, I think our time here is done. So let's start this mission today. All right? All right. Have a good day now. Bye. <laughs> Fuck me. It's always
Valentino always trying to call me up to help him calm down. Oh, why did I even team up with that guy? Oh, anyway, might as well see what everyone else is up to. After all, I have all sorts of uh, cameras and whatnot set up, so let's see what Lucifer's brat of a daughter's up to now. <laughs>